The art, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. The place, the newly opened Gracie Baja Dripping Springs. Chelsea Andrews and I put on our workout clothes and eventually our geese to learn the ways of jiu-jitsu under black belt professors Dungy Santos and Max Bookman. First of all, Professor Max, what is jiu-jitsu? Well, Brazilian jiu-jitsu is a self-defense system like many other martial arts. And this one was developed by the Gracie family in Brazil. And it focuses on containing somebody, perhaps taking them down to the floor, and holding them there or submitting them. Gracie Baja is a worldwide jiu-jitsu team. Don't be fooled by the two R's, it's actually pronounced Baja. You've got the Gracie Baja gyms all over the world, and the mission statement is kind of jiu-jitsu for everyone. Can you tell us a little more about that? Jiu-jitsu for everyone means, you know, we're not just focused on the UFC fighters or the really strong people that are, you know, really want to learn the high-level sport jiu-jitsu. Jiu-jitsu for everyone means we also want to focus on the three-year-olds, maybe the smaller people, the people who aren't into sport jiu-jitsu but just want to know how to defend themselves and want to be empowered by it. Maybe for some of our viewers watching this morning who are interested in it, if they want to come in, they're going to kind of be paired with folks who are of their skill level. It's not like they'll be with the, the young young kids. Learning. For sure, for sure. So we have a kids program, uh, and we also have an adult program. Um, whenever you come in, if you're a beginner, you go through a beginner curriculum, whether the adult beginner curriculum or the kids. Um, and yeah, you're paired with people, your age, your skill level. Professors Dungey and Bookman taught Chelsea and I some basic jiu-jitsu self-defense moves, how to break fall without hitting your head, and then defending yourself on the ground. We turn on the fence. And once you're back on your feet, how to block punches. Professor Dungey joked the metaphor he uses, answering the phone, is something the younger kids don't understand these days. Because he's all on the phones like this, but what we're going to do is answer the phone like old style. So we're going to do like this, answer the phone, answer the phone, answer the phone, answer the phone, and focus on grabbing your head. Then stopping those punches altogether. Answer the phone, answer the phone, and wrap up that arm. Don't let, try to grab the arm like a, holding on to it. Yeah, so I can't really get that hand out. Now, get the underhook, and I can't really throw no more punches. And ultimately taking someone to the ground. Yes. Ah! Whoa! Yes, Chelsea. <laughs> we got to do that again. Sorry, as is typically the case with stories like this, Chelsea Andrews excels in her athletic prowess, while I struggle in the background. But I eventually got it thanks to great teachers. Go, 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 go! You can check out the brand new Gracie Baja Dripping Springs online and on social media. How long have you been practicing jujitsu? I'm a lifetime martial artist. Um, I started competing and studying under Professor Dungey 10 years ago. It's been a lifelong thing. My father's a black belt, my brother's a brown belt. It's, it's the family tradition. What do you like about it? As a coach and a professor, uh, my favorite thing is watching people do something that they thought that they couldn't do. Because um, I, I get to see the moment of these, the self-empowerment just again and again and again. And um, watching somebody maybe a little bit timid or who doesn't, who's never really used the force of their body and pushed into the floor and just mm, figure out that they can do that. And seeing the smile and seeing, seeing how they leave versus how they came in, uh, I think that's my favorite part. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I haven't seen that part at the end. I don't do chance. I love like Yay. I loved it. I was that was good energy. <laughs> I'm so happy right now. Yeah. This was, was so awesome. That was fun. It was fun. It was you a lot did. of fun. I t I mentioned at the beginning of the show you I feel like you almost dislocated I that know. black belt shoulder. Um, I didn't realize he was tapping me. And I was doing this You're and just hurting so his in arm. The moment. I know. Yeah. I felt empowered, like they said. Yeah. And I was hurting him, and I feel bad. One of the students there did Sorry. tell me to enjoy the feeling of taking down a black belt I know. because that will probably never happen. Probably never again. happen. So yeah. I will cherish that. We got forever. special privileges because we were there with yeah. the news, I guess. Um, <laughs> but yeah, they were great teachers. I had every intention of looking like an idiot, and they made us look good. Yep. They, they were, were good teachers. Awesome. Yeah. Cool. We got.